after Stalin, who took control of the Soviet Union? Khrushchev. Khrushchev. All right, so his name was Nikita Khrushchev. And he took control of the Soviet Union after Stalin, right? Now, the way he did it was a little bit of a revisionist because he, um, what he did was kind of undermine or he pointed out all the crimes that Stalin committed. You couldn't go against Stalin, all right? Stalin, if you go against Stalin, jail time, boom. Uh, Stalin was to hear that you were uh, committing treason, j dead. Mm, jail time, dead. Uh, if you didn't go to work that day, you go to you go to prison. Jail time, boom. And in jail, most likely, dead. All right. So, uh, Nikita, which is a Khrushchev here, right? Um, uh, Khrushchev actually kind of like uh, empowered himself by exposing Stalin for the monster that he was, right? Uh, he was a firm leader, strict leader, right? Um, but he did take control of the Soviet Union uh, after Stalin died. I believe Stalin died. Uh, in nineteen fifty-three. There you go. And Khrushchev, he took control 1955 so two years after yeah there was a lot of debate of who was going to control after stalin but this guy nikita khrushchev he definitely took over um now think about it right you have this new dictator that's taken over right and he's pointing out the flaws of your last uh your last uh leader right those that have great relations with your with your previous leader right in this case it was stalin would kind of see you a, a bit of a would be hostilic and unsupportive of the entire nation itself right um we're gonna discuss a little bit more how uh, khrushchev here ruined or kind of drove China into the free trade market uh, and establish uh, the United States. Well, gave, you know, establish an opportunity for the United States and China to have a good relationship. Okay, because when Stalin and China were together, um, we're talking about Xindong, um Xingdong and Stalin, they had a great relationship. When Stalin died, and you see Khrushchev here, you know, pointing out, you know, the monster that Stalin was, uh, the leader of China didn't kind of approve of that, all right? 